How are you tonight? I'm doing great, doing fantastic. Um, we're here to obviously honor all of the, some of the greatest athletes in Seattle. What do you think it is that's so special about this community that brings everyone together here? Well, you know, from I, all sports. Well, I came here back in the 80s, and uh, you know, at that time it was Husky football that uh, everybody was talking about. Uh, when the 90s came around, all of a sudden all sports were just doing well in Seattle. Husky football was, uh, was doing well. Uh, the Sonics were doing well. The Mariners were doing well. The Seahawks, everybody was doing well. And it was just a great time for sports uh, in this community. So it's a lot of tradition here. It's a lot of history. Uh, with our sports team. We've had uh, a lot of athletes to uh, c come from this community and go on to play professional sports. So it's really uh, a great place uh, for entertainment for, for, for the sports teams. Well, and a common thread we've seen out of all the athletes from the different sports here is, is supporting bringing the Sonics back. Yes. <laughs> it's been a, a long fight, but it seems like we're nearing an end hopefully here soon. Do you, do you think that we're going to see that within the next? Well, we're certainly of years? hoping, so, hope so. Uh, you know, I cross my fingers and I'm saying my prayers that uh, we will get a team uh, back in Seattle. We certainly deserve it. Uh, we we shouldn't have never lost uh, the franchise, but uh, I think the NBA uh, recognized that uh, this is a really good market for not only uh, uh, NBA basketball but all mm -hmm. sports. You know our. As I mentioned, our college teams, uh, professional teams, now we have soccer. Everybody's doing well, mm -hmm. and, and, um, and the fan base all supports us. You know? So uh, I think uh, it will happen. I'm hoping, certainly hoping, yeah. uh, that it will happen soon. We have a beautiful brand new arena all yeah. ready to go. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I attended uh, 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 the Krakens game there, and beautiful uh, yeah. facility. Uh, is set up for both hockey and NBA, yeah. and I think that was done for a reason. So I'm hoping that uh, the NBA will take a look at that and see that really Seattle has everything it needs uh, to bring back the franchise, even the support uh, of the fan base, and uh, we hope that that happens soon. I really hope so too. Yeah. It seems like we should have all the major sports here because yeah. of the community that we talked yeah. about and the fans yeah. and, and everything that we have yeah. here. Um, but I also heard that you uh, started a foundation recently. Yeah. What is that? Yeah, I just started my foundation, uh, the Nate McMillan Foundation. Uh, and it, uh, it's a mentorship program for fatherless boys, uh, 10 to 18. I was a fatherless kid growing up. Uh, and I, did, I had, but I had role models and I had an older brother and I had father figures and, and leaders and teachers and coaches and, uh, you know, people in the community uh, that helped me uh, become, you know, the person that I am today. All of those people are, fa are bricks in my foundation. And I want to provide that for uh, these young boys, uh, you know, 10 to 18, to give them some guidance, to empower them, uh, give them the tools. Uh, basically to transition from uh, a boy to a man. Well, good luck in growing that. That's an yeah. awesome cause. Yeah, well, thank you. And thanks for taking some time with us. All right, thank you for having me.